Hey guys, Jamie Sake Marsh here, and I'm ready to talk to you about viral inbox. Um, I hope this is the first video you're watching uh, before you went to uh, look around the directory of uh, Safeless, um, as the video above indicated. Um, this will be your in most important tool, uh, bar none, uh, in a Safeless campaign. Um, I know when I started out with my Safeless campaign, I had uh, not started using Viral Inbox and uh, found it very difficult and struggled to keep myself organized and uh, get enough credits and you know not be wasting my time. When I found Viral Inbox, I migrated all of my existing um, uh, safe list into Viral Inbox and uh, that's when the directory of safe list started to manifest itself into a incredibly useful tool. So what I need you to do is I need you to uh, Take a look at this video so that I can explain to you why it is such a powerful tool and why you should not ignore this tool. It's free to join, um, although this is probably the one um, product I will I will recommend you're upgrading and I'll explain to you why when you get on the inside. But it is free to join and you don't have to upgrade. So don't think that by joining you're going to end up having to upgrade. You don't have to. Just click the link below. There's a big green button down there that says Join Viral Inbox. Click that link. Join Viral Inbox. First thing you do before you join any safe list. If you're already a member of safe list that you've started from campaigns before, don't worry about it. You can add them to Viral Inbox. Not a big deal. You just go into your uh, existing safe list and you just go in and change the. Um, uh, I forget what they call it now. The your, your list email. So when you go into your list email, you go and just change it into your other ones. It'll ask you to confirm it when you go into Viral Inbox, but I'll show you all that inside. Okay, guys. So what we're going to do is I'm just going to show you this little spot right here. This is how you create your account. First name, last name, username. This is an important. You're going to need this back into the directory of safe list because you're going to need to put it in there. Um, so keep in mind what you type in here. Um, in addition, also take a pick from the type of email address you're going to want to work with uh, with Viral Inbox. Um, I would pick one that's easy for you to remember, one that you like, one that uh, you know sticks in your head, like reply.cm or too cool for too cool .us, uh, you know whatever. You take your pick. Um, saying that's not doesn't exist because I'll just put that in there and it'll probably work. So, and then we need a password and then of course standard stuff. Uh, put in your PayPal uh, address in here. Um, accept the terms. Um, and then click claim my inbox. That'll take you inside. Um, what you'll find is exactly what you're going to find here, less all of the mailboxes. Okay, I'm going to log in. Okay, so here we are on the inside of Viral Inbox. So what you're uh, going to notice is yours will be empty on this side. It'll be nothing here on the left hand side. Okay, what I suggest that you do is you go over to the right hand side before you start doing anything else and check out all the different tabs here: address book, news, mailer, mailer. Because Viral Inbox also uh, not only a, a very valuable. Um, um, mail client because you can use it just as a mail client uh, you also going to want to use uh, it also is a safe list so you can use it as a mailer um, I can send up to 251 members right now and I have I think like 15 credits so I don't use this one as a, a mailer per se but I have got credits for it um, but it is the one that I use least for uh, actually sending out emails affiliate section if you want to um, uh, promote the uh, viral inbox uh, separately um, it, although um, it, it is a, an incredible tool so I would promote it to everybody um, tools this is an important uh, tab to check in because it shows you all the different things that you can utilize to help you uh, organize yourself I'm gonna go through most of that with you but I do recommend that you check all these things out settings here are the upgrade options you're gonna want to check that out um, as I mentioned upgrading is a, a good idea based on what uh, um, uh, the fact that it's such a powerful tool. Uh, one of the reasons why I would recommend upgrading is um, you get a maximum number of uh, uh, email boxes that you can uh, create over here when you're uh, a free member. However, again, you can start out free, get it going, and you'll find the value. As soon as you start using it, you'll see the value. I know you will. Um, so, n without further ado, I'm going to show you how this works. I mean, as I said, this is a basic mail client. You can click on new message, bring it over here. You can put in your recipient. You can type in your body, hit send. It's just like sending a regular email. It shows you the email, all the addresses you can use where you're sending it from, because these are all the safe lists that you've cre I've created. Uh, just go back and we'll take a look. Um, now, the powerful part of this is quite simple. 
let's think about safe list guys what do you got to do if you're in a free system uh, or you're pardon me you're creating a free safe list campaign or you have very small budget so you're not wanting to spend any money on safe lists or any of that kind of thing you need to click for credits that's the only way you're going to get credits very few of the safe list memberships will give you credits on a monthly basis on in in the free membership um, that's another reason why you might upgrade to certain um, uh, on certain safe lists out there, the upgrading gets you credits um, monthly uh, in addition uh, to more frequent mailings. So normally you can send one, one, e uh, one a batch of emails once every three days, but when you become a pro member of some of these sites, you can send uh, twice a day or three times a day. So you're sending that much more, plus they give you 200,000 credits or something a month just to spend on that kind of stuff. So there's certain value to upgrading. However, free campaign, we're talking about clicking for credits. So the reason why this is such a valuable tool, as you might have guessed with the list of uh, email addresses on the la uh, or emails on the side, it could get pretty daunting to have 9,000 emails coming into your inbox and then having to sift through them. Let's take a look. If I only had one inbox, so I'll say list bonuses here, list there, reactive, list list jumpers. Now I have to sift through, keep track how many of these I'm going to be checking. Okay, I did midnight. There's only one there. Okay, I got to remember I only did one. And you're going back and forth, back and forth, clipping, you know, trying to figure out cooking credits, cooking credits. Um, when it's organized like this, I go here. All these are ad cheever. I go here, all these are Busby ads. I go here, all these are Beweeble ads. I go here, all these are easy ma mail ma cash ads. So I can click for credits based on the different individual ones. Now, that in itself is awesome. And I did create a video about clicking for credits. Look for it in the uh, directory of uh, <coughs> SafeList. I did create an entire video just on that so I can show you how to get it done in, in under 30 minutes and cre and check and click for credits for like 20 or 30 safe lists every day. So you're going to have tons of credits to work with. You're going to be sending out thousands and thousands of emails a week so that you can um, get uh, your list built. Okay. Now, as I hover over this, you'll notice something about the email address. Right? Okay, so I'm going to open up a notepad so I can show you this. Here's notepad. When I opened up my viral inbox account, here's what I created as a username, okay? Uh, and I told you about creating your username. That was my username in viral inbox, okay, when I first started, username, okay? Then there was the space in between the username and the tail end of the, uh, the, the email that they wanted you to set up. So uh, this is my username right here. Then I chose to go with fivebox.me, okay, so that was the email address I chose. So this is my viral inbox email. This is my viral inbox username. And now when I wanted to join the Adchiever website, when I went through the joining of the safe list, it's standard stuff, first name, last name, username. Uh, and a lot of them have two emails that they want from you. They want your list email and they want your sender email. Not all of them do this, so if it doesn't do it, don't panic and think anything's gone wrong. Um, but when they have two of them, what they're looking for is a list email is going to be where all of the people in the list are going to send their emails. That's the one you want to put into Viral Inbox. So here's the magic. Here's my username, or here's my email address for, Vibo for vibox.me. In order for it to create that folder that says Adchiever, while I'm signing up for Adchiever, I put this in as my uh, put this in as my email address, mybox.me. So as you can see, I took this and all I did was add in dot adchiever. When the emails came to my inbox, they ended. They started down here in pending. Okay. Once they're down here in pending, you have to go in here and approve the mailbox. Once you approve the mailbox, it moves it into approved mailboxes, clearly. Um, and as you can see, under Adchiever, there is my email, right? So it created the folder. It created it for Busby Ads, it created it for Beweeble, created it for Elite, created it for Easy Mail Cache, etc., etc. And what that means is that every email that comes from a list adventure, every email that comes from List Bonus, List Joe, List Jumper, Midnight Sun, they'll all end up in those folders as I click on here and you can see Midnight Sun Safe List. So 
it keeps them organized. This is what a regular mailbox would look like all over the map. This is what it looks like when they're organized. And you know, I didn't have to create these folders, I didn't have to make rules, I didn't have to do any of that. All I did was simply use this as my list email, this told Viral Inbox to create the folder and create the rule. All done for you. Sender email, I would recommend highly a Gmail account of some kind. Okay? So that uh, you're not likely to get very much mail to this Gmail account. However, <coughs> when you um, when people do uh, upgrade to pro memberships in some of the safe lists, they do have access to your Gmail, uh, to your sender email. Uh, you're not going to get a lot of those, so don't worry about that too much. This is the trick right here, guys. Okay. So what I need you to do is, without further ado, click that big green button down below that says Join Viral Inbox. Get in there, check out all this information on the right hand side, start joining some uh, safe lists and putting it together. There is some uh, tutorials about how to create this email just like I've done uh, and uh, inside here, so that should help. Alright guys, good luck, let's get started.